Hello, hello everyone. Hello, hello everyone. God bless you. God bless you everyone here. Everybody joining me this evening. Praise the Lord, hallelujah. Before I share my message this uh, evening, God bless you everyone. Thank you so much for this blessing that uh, this evening I can share the gospel of God already. Always remember, God is moving. Amen. Still, God is control of this world. Anak, anak man on earth. Everything, everything in this world is in God's hand and everything in this world Okay, the day of judgment in God's hand. Thank you, Father God, for uh, this evening, Father God. That you bless me to continue my assignment to spread your gospel and kingdom. Thank you, Father God, for these blessings. I owe it to you, my Lord, to serve you and to follow your son, Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father, for strength that you're giving me and to be kind and humble to everyone and to be patient to wait in your time to spread your gospel. Thank you, Father God, for your grace and mercy. Thank you, Father God, for your Son, Lord Jesus Christ, that you sent unto the world to save to save all mankind's sins in this world. I pray, I pray, Father God, that this evening, Father God, that you are the one to lead me to spread your gospel, that you are the one to teach me in my whole mind and heart, my body and souls. In Jesus' blood, I pray. Amen. God bless you, everyone. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, everyone here. I miss you all. God bless you, everyone. Uh, I will say belated happy birthday for uh, my big teddy bear, Bradley Glide Bridge Senior. Happy birthday, belated happy birthday, big teddy bear. God bless you. And also my prayers, prayer requests uh, for uh, the son of my cousin in Manila, Philippines, Rosita Galilea. Rosita Ostaga Galilea of, uh, of her son that was in dialysis. So all prayer warriors, I'm calling you all prayer warriors to pray for uh, my nephew that he was in dialysis. Continue praying for Sister uh, Valerie Black in USA for uh, her sickness cancer and also for Jima Kosipa. Continue prayers and also continue praying for Pastor Piper Kid Kirk Continue praying for Habi uh, Virasso and also for Robert Burns. All prayer warriors. Okay, now here we are. God bless you, everyone. Hey, Luna Bill. Hi, Nustaga. Now my cousin, she is watching from Kuwait. God bless you. God bless you, everyone here. Okay, so I will continue in the box of revelations. God bless you. God blessings upon us. So and I will continue my revelation chapter 16, 1 up to... 21. Okay. Revelation chapter 16. The revelations of chapter 16. This is the start. This is the start. Okay. The judgment. The judgment of this planet Earth. Hello, brother Darino. Thank you. God bless you, brother. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. So if we start in the box of revelations, we are facing. Okay. We are in the box of revelation. The start of judgment of the planet earth amen in the box of revelation 16 and now i will read this 16 1 up to 21 so john was saying and i heard a great voice out of the temple saying to the seven seven angels go your ways and pour out the vials of the wrath of god upon the earth amen so it was saying, John was saying, okay, John heard, okay, a great voice, okay, the great voice out of the temple saying, the seven angels, that they, that the seven angels, they need to go their ways and pour out the vials of the wrath of God upon the earth. To so the seven angels, they will pour in their way, if where is their way? 
the bias, okay? The bias of the wrath of God. Number two, and the first when it means is the first angel, okay, went and poured out his vials upon the earth. So the one angel poured out the vials here unto the earth, okay? And their fill, okay, of noisome and grievous sore upon the men which had the mark of the beast. This is the start of judgments on the planet earth, okay? So it was saying is which, okay? Sore upon the men which had the mark of the beast, and upon them which worshipped, okay, his image. Number three, and the second angel poured out his vial upon the sea. So the other one angel poured out his vial upon the seas, and it became as the blood of a dead man, and every living every living soul okay died in the sea so the other one the next angel amen the second angel okay the second angel pulled out okay and those people around the world they still not believe but i will read in the box of revelation hello sister on the may god bless you everyone here god bless you okay so the, the second angel he put out his vial upon the sea, and the sea it became blood, okay, of the dead men and every and every okay, and every living souls did in the sea. And four, and the third angel, because there are seven angels, and the third angels, this is not all people around the world, this is not a joke, and this is not this is not like you are only having fun this is going to happen you like it or not you believe it or not it's going to happen amen okay so here we are and the third angel poured out his vial upon the rivers and fountains amen fountains of waters and they became blood and three and five, I will read it all. And I heard, and John was saying, and I heard the angels of the waters say, Thou art righteous, O Lord, which art and wash and shall be because thou hast judged thus. Okay. So what what, what is saying in verse five? Okay. So the angel was asking, okay, to our Lord God, amen, which art, asking, which art, amen, and wash, amen, and shall be, amen, shall be, because thou hast judged thus. It means is, I know everyone, you understand? Amen. Six. Continue. For they have, for they have shed the blood of saints and prophets, and thou hast given them blood to drink, for they are worthy. Okay. And seven. And I heard, okay, another out of the altar and say, Amen. In seven. Even so, Lord God Almighty, Amen. True and right, choose our thy judgment. And eight, I will read it out first. And the fourth angel poured out his vial upon upon the sun. So the fourth, the fourth angel, okay, he poured out his vial upon the sun, upon the suns from up. Okay, and power, and power was given unto him to scorch men with fire. Amen. So when the fourth angel, okay, poured out his vial upon the sun, the sun is from up, it's not down, okay, upon the sun, and the power was given Okay, the power was given unto him, okay, 
scorch men with fire. It's very clear. Nine. Okay. Nine. And men were scorched with great heat and blaspheme. Okay. The name of God, which had power, okay, over close plugs as they repented not to not to give him okay repented okay not to give him glory what means okay repented but not give the people don't want to repent and not to give glory to our lord god and then and the fifth angel poured out his vial upon the seat of the beast and his kingdom was full of darkness this is the fifth angel amen the kingdom was full of darkness okay and genuine their tongues for pain the tongue for pains and 11 and blasphemed okay blasphemed the god of heaven the god of heaven because of their pain and their source and repented not of their deeds and the sixth angel put out his vial upon the great river of Euphrates, and the water thereof was dried up the way of the king of the east might be prepared 11 at 13 god bless you brother adam god bless you and i saw the three unclean spirit like like frogs the unclean spirit like frogs come out of the mouth of the dragon okay so the unclean spirit that like a frogs is coming out okay is coming out okay the mouth of the dragon okay who is the dragon everyone you understand who is the dragon if if, if i throw back in my in 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 revelation chapter Chapter 10 up, dragon is the devil. Okay, here we are. And out of the mouth of the beast, okay, and out and out. It was saying, it's very clear. I will I will read it again. And I saw three unclean spirits like a frog come out of the mouth of the dragon and out of the mouth of the beast and out of the mouth of the false prophets here we are for they are for they are okay spirits of devil here we are working miracles okay working miracles which go forth unto the king of the earth oh, king of the earth so it was saying okay 14 for they are the spirits of the devil okay working the miracles which which go forth unto the king of the earth then who is the king of the earth for those people for those people that they are christian amen for those people who's christian they are claiming christian but you understand if who is the king of the earth the king of the earth is lucifer okay, here we are working miracles okay which go forth unto the king of the earth and of and of the whole world here we are this is what we call the false prophet teaching teaching and serve the king of the earth or the whole world amen teaching how the way they teach the gospel but they are serving the king of the earth why because they are false teaching and are not are not following if what the bible say amen this is what we call they call even here in in the bible is a false prophets okay here we are 
You can do imagine which go forth unto the king of the earth and of the whole world. Okay? To gather. It means to gather. It means is together. Together. Okay? To gather them the battle of the great of the great day of God Almighty. It means is all the devil, all the devil and clean spirit, even all these false prophet and clean spirit, okay, they can make miracle, make miracle on earth, okay? It was saying is serving the king of the earth and the whole world. So then, remember, some people, okay, can preach the gospel. Some people read the Bible. Some people, brothers and sisters in Christ, okay, they use the gospel of God to spread, but it's not, it's not, it's not following if what is the Bible say only they spread with their own understanding. Amen. Why I'm saying? Why Bila is saying? Why does all of this? All of these people are preachers around the world and all over the world. All these popular preacher, pastor, and all over the world. They are saving souls. No. Why I am saying? The answer is why they became millionaire in this world. This popular preacher. These people are pastor. Amen. This is the truth. No one can say no. This is the truth. Why? Because suppose if we follow Jesus Christ, if we stand, if we stand for the commandment, if what the Bible say, we don't care about the world. Amen. We don't care whatever it is. Amen. So then, then why? Why all of these popular preachers became millionaire? Because they are serving the king of the earth, of the whole world. is Satan. Okay, continue. 15. Behold. Okay, here we are. Jesus was saying. Behold, I come as a thief. Bless is he that watch it and keep it his garment, lest he walk naked and they see his shame. Amen. It was right. So it means is Jesus was saying, Behold, I come like a thief. Of course, Jesus will come like a thief and nobody knows. Only the Father and the Son. Even the angels doesn't know if when, what time, what hour, what day. Only the Father and the Son. Amen. 16. And he gathered them together into a place called the Hebrews Tang Armagedon. 17. And the seventh angel poured out his vial into, into the air. And there came a great voice out of the temple of heaven. Amen. From the throne saying it is done amen from the throne saying it is done who is done in this world who saved the sins of mankind in this planet earth it is done jesus jesus christ he is done for all mankind in this world. He is done for all of us. Okay, continue. 18. And there were voice of thunders and lightning, and there was a great earthquake such as was not seen. Okay, 18. Since Men were, men were upon the earth, so mighty an earthquake, and so great. 19. And the great city was divided. The great city divided into a three parts. Okay. 
the cities you will you will see it later on if i preach again tomorrow again okay and the cities of the nation so it was saying the cities and the nation the nations feel okay here we are and great babylon okay came in remembrance before god okay to give to give unto her the great babylon it was saying it remembrance before god to give unto her the cup of the wines of the firstness of his okay of his wrath 20 and every islands every islands this is the planet earth and there is if we see the planet earth still have islands islands floating on the water especially my beloved country in the philippines we have a lot of islands in the philippines okay so every islands lead away in revelation chapter 16 verse 20 verse 20 it was saying every island will flee away it's like this pew like this blow away like that okay and the mountains okay and the mountains were not found so every island in every nation amen you cannot see already even those the mountains because every island is going to flee, is blow away. Amen. 21. And there fell upon men a great hail out of heaven. Every stone about the way of a talent. And men blasphemed God because of the plug of the hail. For the plug, for the plug thereof was exceeding great here we are so if you read if you read now we start in 16 in revelation 16 i 17 okay i am already in revelation 16 okay <clears throat> in 17 this is the 16 is the start of the judgment of god until the end of revelation so where is the part we are facing this time god bless you brother good morning the place the place that what we are facing this time we are already in the middle of revelation we are in the middle of revelation okay it's more amen it's more it's going getting closer in the middle of revelations why because in 16 okay in 16 in if you read in revelation 16 amen this is what saying already the start of the judgment amen so what are what are what's going on in this world today the mark of the beast so it means it's the mark of the beast here is i am ready in the revelation 16 is coming out all the false prophet all the people was coming out now amen okay here we are so in the revelation 16 speak back pick back up the account of god judgment on the week amen it described the bowls judgment the third seventh part of god's wrath described in the books of revelations before this okay before this were seven seals before this okay in the seven seals seven seals judgment the last of which were the trumpets the trumpets judgment okay total seven the last of which were these bowls of the wrath of God. The first bowls of judgment bring harmful and painful source to those who 
Kairi. Okay? Kairi, the mark of the beast. Amen. The mark of the beast. Then, what's happening this time in the whole world? What's going on this time? What we are facing this time? Mentioning about the mark of the beast. Amen. Everyone, you understand. Amen. The source to those who carry the mark of the beast. The second judgment turns sea into blood. The sea is going to be the blood. Amen. Blood and kills all the marine life. It means is all in the sea. Killed all in the sea. Because of the waters became blood. It means is all this fish, all if what is living in the water, is all dead. All die. Amen. And the third ball's judgment turn river or okay, spring into blood. Okay. Unlike before, okay, where just some portions of the sea or rivers, amen, portion of the sea or river was affected. This even appears to ruin all waters throughout the entire earth as revelation. If you read Revelation chapter 16, 1 to 4. Amen. Following, following the third ball of judgment, an angel declare, angel declare that God is just to avenge the weak for their murderous act against the saints and prophets. The angel declaration is met with full agreement from the voice from the altar, okay, as a revelation, okay, in 5 to 7. The fourth judgment scorched the wicked, okay, with fire. But instead, instead of repenting, okay, instead people will repent. Okay, the unbeliever curse God. Here we are. Amen. So it it means is instead the people all around the world to repent. To confess all their sins. And ask God for forgiveness. But they cursing God. This is the problem of the world today. Amen. The world today. Amen. Instead people will repent. Amen. Instead people ask for forgiveness. Amen. Instead people. Instead people that accept Jesus. But they are still cursing God. They refuse to repent. Because of the world, amen, the world that all lies, amen, to poison their minds because of the king of the earth, the whole world, amen, people, people keep blinded, even they having eyes, they don't want, they don't want to see it. Even though they, do, they have ear, they don't want to hear it. This is the problems of all people around the world. Amen. So instead to repent, instead to turn back to our Lord God, instead to ask for forgiveness, people still refuse but this is this is, is going to happen. If you still not wake up all your mind. Amen. So the fourth judgment scored weak fire, but instead of repenting, the unbeliever cursed God. 
This might mean there will be reduction in the earth natural protection from the sun. Okay, allowing is to burn the people on earth. Amen. The peep bowl of judgment plugs. Unlike, okay, the peep bowl, the judgment, <clears throat> the kingdom of the beast into darkness. The wicked respond by gnawing their tongues in anguish by cursing God. The six judgments dry up the Euphrates to prepare the way for the king of the S. Next, demons assemble the king of the whole earth to battle against God at locations referred as Armageddon. I'm back, sorry, because the driver came back again. Okay, so the kingdom of the beast into darkness. The wicked responds, okay, by genuine tongue in anger, okay, by cursing God. So the six judgments dry up the Euphrates to prepare the way of the king of the S. So next, the demons assemble the king of the whole earth to battle. The king, the king of the whole earth to battle it means is Lucifer is the king of the earth okay to battle okay against against god at at locations referred to as armageddon i mean meaning okay hill or mountain or of majidu okay in revelation chapter 16 verse 8 the seventh balls of judgment bring about an earthquake that split Jerusalem into the three parts. Also, as a result of this earthquake, the city's worldwide fall. Amen. Babylon feels God's wrath. Islands flee, mountains crumble, and hailstones weighing about. 100 pounds or about 45 kilos bombards people. Still, even the weak refuse, even the weak refuse to repent. Amen. Still refuse to repent. <clears throat> instead, instead, they curse God. Okay. As in Revelation chapter 16, 17 to 21. Instead, the people to repent, but still they are cursing God. And it's too sad. Amen. At this point, earth has been fatal, fatally ruined. The earth, okay, is fatally ruined and the tribulation is all but over. In chapter 17 and 18, chapter 17 and 18 will go into a great details and some of it is written poetic to descriptive to further explain fall of the week. Okay, in chapter 19 will pick back up of the moments by moments. Okay, descriptions of the ends of time, ends of time of this planet earth hello sisi liliana good morning god bless you sisi including this is okay the description until the end of the revelation the whole revelation chapter verse 1 until the end verses of 21 amen is the end the end time including the second coming of jesus christ so all this all this going to happen and then the earthquake
fire, war, everything, mark of the beast, false prophet, everything, those people who you are serving Satan, amen, serving Satan, only Satan poison your mind, okay, that you will come with him in the nations in the lake of fire. But then, all of this happened that even though the sun, the sun is going to be fired, the water on the sea is going to be blood. Then at the end, the ends of the world, amen, the ends of times of the world, now you can see Jesus Christ on the top of the cloud. Jesus will come. And if who is belongs to Jesus, that died for Jesus, stand for Jesus, is separate for those people who are cursing God and refuse to repent while you are here on earth. And it's going to happen. So then, the world, the world, we are in getting close in chapter 16, start of judgment of the planet Earth. It means it's, it's very getting close. After chapter 16, start of judgment until the end. In 21 of Revelation, that you can see already if what's going on is getting worse. Amen. The blood on the sea. Amen. The islands fled away. And no cannot, you cannot see already the mountains. Amen. Everything, everything on earth. The time Jesus will come on up on up jesus will come wearing a white linen clothes white like a snow with his army's angels riding on the white horse amen so when jesus will come on top all all servants of god who died for Jesus, amen, it's separated. Separated already for those people who loves the world and refuse to repent and still cursing God. Don't use the words of God to spread. You need to repent. Whatever you want to do it in this world, still in God's hands, the judgment. Jesus will come, you like it or not, but Jesus will come the second time of coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. So you are all claiming all whatever you want here, all around the world. Amen. Whatever you want to say it, whatever you want to do it, whatever it is. But still, the judgment in God's hand. Amen. In God's hand. You cannot feel what's going on in this the world. You are still people. You refuse to repent. You are still people cursing God. You are still people rejecting Him. Amen. And still people don't believe it. Because of the kings of the world, the kings of the earth. Here you are, still you are, still continue lying. Amen. Then, it's very simply the answers. Heal is ready for those people don't refuse to repent. Amen. And it's not funny is not a joke we are not playing here on earth 
us. Amen. So for those people here in planet earth, amen. For those people, even those, the gospel of God, you are using the gospel of God to spread here in planet earth. Remember still the judgment of God in his hand. Because God is the one created all here in planet earth. Amen. So my my message is very simply. Amen. It's very simply. If you don't want to repent, if you are still cursing God, if you are still rejecting Him, it's your souls. If you don't want to be saved, he is ready for you, for anyone. Amen. Then why you cannot open your mind? If you read in the Old Testament, Amen. It's a very simple example. In the Old Testament, the rich man and the poor man, Lazarus. Only this the example. Example in Old Testament. That the rich man asking Father Abraham, okay, to dip this, this, okay, in tongue of Lazarus because he is real. It's very hard. Then why you are still continue on earth? It means is you are proud about hell. We understood. We understood because of their mind, okay. Field of the spirit of the devil. This is why they say it was like their mind is blacked out. Their heart, their heart, it's no love. Amen. They doesn't know what they are talking or speaking for other people. Because of the unclean spirit, the devil spirit inside them what we gonna do being a believers we need to stand firm what what how can we help them through our prayers prayers amen this is all this is all what we gonna do is prayers for all those people to touch their whole mind and heart. Amen. That the judgment of God is getting closer. For those people don't want to hear it, but it's going to happen. For those people keep blinded, but it's going to happen. You like it or not, believe it or not, but still God is in control from up. He is from up. Who is the most powerful here on earth? Even those I can see, even those in here in Revelation, the king of the earth and the whole world. It means is, is Satan. So it means is this is the earth. It's a very, a very simply. This is the earth. Where is heaven? It's from up. So which one is which one is the most high? Earth or heaven? Amen. Only is very clear. The king of the earth, only here on earth, to destroy, to keep you blinded, to poison your mind. To attract in your eyes for all belongs to the world. So that Satan, okay, can take you away to having eternal life. Satan will take you away, okay, that you will not live in paradise and heaven. He will bring you in hell because of your eyes keep blinded. 
because all of this attraction in all over the world. Amen. But still God is from up. Amen. My point, everyone, how the way you teach the gospel, amen, it's better to speak the truth. Why I am saying, because still God's from up, He knows everything, all of us in this world. It'll, it will not win. It will not win the lies of the world with the power of God. With His Son, Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. So for those people, how the way you are in all over the world, I don't care. So amen. But still God, He is still in control. And still God's from up. He's the one to judge all of us. If who is belongs to him, judge the planet earth. And this is the truth. The power of people on earth, only here on earth. Amen. To destroy the world, to destroy the people. But the power of God from up, heaven and earth and under the earth. This is his power. Amen. For those people refuse to repent. For those people cursing God. For those people rejecting God. He is ready for all of you. If you don't want to live forever. Amen. God still giving us a time for all of us. To repent. Even me. I am sharing the gospel here. But all the time. I confess all my sins. And ask for forgiveness. I repent. Because I am still. A sinner. Because we born to be a sinner. We all sinners. We are all born to be a sinner. This is why we always confess. All our sins. And ask for forgiveness. And kick the world. Separated the world. Change your lifestyle. Put Jesus first. Put God first. Amen. Let me explain. For those people. Always went to church. After get out in church. It's nothing happened. It's still just like that. Show the world. I went to church. After get out the church. Okay then. It's finished. I went to church. How about you're in reality people? Reality. We are talking about reality. Real. Genuine. Why? Because God is real. Jesus is real. This is why we are talking to live in real, in reality, and not to having fun. Amen. The judgment is not for having fun. Amen. So then you are people here. Amen. So remember, today I share. The books of Revelation chapter 16, the start of the judgment of God. Now, it's not yet the judgment. It's not yet, but it's still getting close. We are to start in Revelation 16. Which you can read the mark of the beast, the false prophet. The false teachers, even all this for the king of the world, the kings of the earth, is for Lucifer, the people worship the image by man 
handmade and not the worship and the spirit of gods from up. Why did you worship the image man's made and not worship from up? Amen. I can see here in the ministry posting, posting in the ministry asking, you can see God? People posting in the ministry. You can see God and then post. And people asking, who is God? My answer is, is no wisdom and knowledge from God. That's why they couldn't understand. Even those they are Christian. What we gonna do? Prayers. Prayers to our Lord God. To give us more wisdom and knowledge and understanding. To understand everything if what the Bible say. Amen. I'm not I'm not perfect. I'm still a sinner, but I teach myself. I teach myself to always doing good daily. If I got mistake, I ask for forgiveness. I confess, I repent, and not to repeat it again. Amen. So remember, the judgment of God is real. The hell is real. Heaven is real. For those people don't believe it, nobody forcing anyone to believe it. But God give us time to repent so that, so that through His Son Lord Jesus Christ, we having to live eternal life forever. Amen. And remember, even God not forcing you, anyone, to believe it. But remember, God, through His one begotten Son, He sent into this world. It means is Jesus came already for the first time. He became a man. Then still people, you refuse to repent. Did you know what Jesus say to Peter when they do fishing? Jesus was saying, live to being a fisher. Come with me and follow me. This is Jesus want us to do, to follow him. Because if you will not follow him and you rejecting him, you don't want to repent. It means is you choose the damnations, the lake of fire in hell because you refuse. Amen. So it's two sides for all the people around the world. All the false prophet, the mark of the beast, all this what's happened. To all my brothers and sisters around the world. You like it or not. You believe it or not. Whatever is it in your head. But still God's. No more delay of the judgment. Because God how many times give us a chance to repent. But still people don't want to repent. To the judgment. Time of judgment. Amen. So this is my my message to church audio this evening. Revelation chapter 16. The whole chapter, 1 up to 21 verses. 17. I will continue to read the scripture of the books of Revelations until the end so that people you will understand the world today is what's happening this planet earth amen god bless you everyone here thank you so much hello cc susie peters thank you so much cc god bless you i really appreciate angeline Khaled. susie peters really appreciates here 
Sister Liliana Lily, I know you are working. Good morning, CC. God bless you, Hazel Anglin. Thank you so much. Les Saint Peter, God bless you, brother. Thank you so much. Dari Nok, thank you so much, everyone here. God bless you, Bradley Glad Bridge in your big titty. Thank you so much. Adam Lovell, God bless you, everyone here. Briley Bio, Briley Bio, God bless you. My nephew, no, he is watching. J Tells Anus Juveta, God bless you, everyone. Thank you so much, Sister Ronda May. Bradley Hyder. Nabil Ha Inostaga, my cousin, she is watching. God bless you, everyone. Remember for all people around the world what we gonna do on earth. It's a very simply. It's a very simply the answers. The answers is the answers for all of us. Still God is from up. Remember, He is created this heaven and earth. Heaven and earth and living things. And created us it means is because all of this God's given us and he created for all of this and you are people destroying amen and instead you worship him you worship you worship the world and you worship all the images or idols in this world and your ear you don't want to hear the truth you are still keep like you don't hear nothing and even your eyes that God gives you eyes to see but you people still keep blinded but remember it's still in God's hands the judgment nobody force you if you believe it or not amen but the second coming of Jesus Christ the second coming of Jesus Christ you will see on the clouds from heaven going down on earth riding in a white horse the white horse still have the wings and the angels armies amen nobody 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 force you if you believe it or not amen it's your choice it's your life but it's going to happen. Amen. It's going to happen. Amen. So don't say that if you are already on hill, and then you will say that, forgive me for a second chance. It's too late. Why? While you are on earth, you refuse to repent. Because you want only your desires of your flesh, that mind only thinking the world to be happy. Amen. All of this, if what God's given us, all you refuse and reject it. It's no more. It's no more. Amen. But one day, not only here in Facebook, you can see Bella preaching the gospel. When I reach my country in the Philippines, you can see me in everywhere. I spread the gospel of God and I'm not ashamed to spread the gospel of God in everywhere. God will bless me. Amen. So for those people who don't believe the Bible, it's up to you. Amen. God not forcing anyone, but still God is good all the time for all of us. He is He is patient to always delay, but now no more delay. Amen. But tomorrow you will hear about 17. Okay, the Babylon is fallen. Amen. So tomorrow I explain the Babylon. The great city, the whole planet Earth. Amen. This is Bella Ostaga, the founder of Bella's ministry, the power of God's ministry, and the power of God's church. Warrior of Christ and united for Christ. But the power of God's church, not only here in Facebook. The power of God's church is my real building church in Manila, Philippines. As much as I can spread the gospel. As much as I can help 
the children, the children on the street. Amen. I don't care for everyone. If what God's given me, I will continue my job. Amen. We are here not for rising. Oh, we are here not to become rich, to become millionaire. We are here for soul savage. It means saving souls. It means is to speak the truth. Amen. It's not for sharing the gospel or preaching the gospel to become wealthy around the world. To having a private jet. This is not you are God serving. You are serving God, the king of the earth. Period. Amen. You see how Jesus he preached? He's wearing slipper in everywhere. She didn't have this popular preacher having this, having this, how the way they wear their clothes. Amen. So you are serving God or you are serving the gods of this earth. Amen. So God bless you, everyone. Good evening. God bless you. Thank you, Susie Peters. Bradley Great Bridge Senior. Thank you so much, Big Teddy Bear. Everyone here. God's blessings upon us. Good evening from here in the Middle East.